Hey guys, what's going on and welcome to today's sub request video where you guys have requested me to try out or review a specific product and for today we have is the Makeup Revolutions Reloaded Velvet Rose Eyeshadow Palette where I have already done two eye looks using this palette and uh, Mahibul Mahin had requested me to create another eye look. I am so freaking sorry that it took me two months two whole months to do this other eye look because I literally forgot and thanks to Ocean Mina who actually reminded me that hey have you forgotten so I am so sorry you guys that I kind of forgot but today we have not just one but two eye looks using this eyeshadow palette now this beautiful eyeshadow palette I have already done another video with two eye looks which I will link it right up so do check it out if you are interested however these are priced at 850 rupees and I picked up mine from hokmakeup.com and they are usually on sale so like for example right now it is available for 637 rupees only now before we can get into the details and the eye look do not forget to subscribe to my channel and click on the bell icon right next to it so that you're notified whenever I do upload and now let's jump right into the video so in this video the first eye look that I created is a beautiful matte brown smoky eyes no matter what your skin tone is it will look beautiful on you and it is also pretty simple and the second eye look is the one that I'm wearing right now which has a mix of gold some rose gold some black brown and reddish brown as well I have tried to use as many colors as I can from this palette I hope you guys enjoy it and also bear in mind that all the brushes that I use are from Aliexpress so just FYI and I hope you guys enjoy this tutorial and let's finally jump into the video so as always I'm using the Maybelline Age Rewind to set my eyelids however I'm not using any loose powder because I want the colors to pop so for the first shade I'm taking this color right here which is number 12 and I'm gonna take it in a nice fluffy brush like this so I'm going to concentrate this color only on the crease and above Now for the next brown color, I'm going to go with this shade right here, which is number six. And then take a nice packing brush like this one and lightly go over the crease just to warm it up a bit. And next I'm going to go with this beautiful chocolatey brown shade right here which is number three and I'm going to just pack this color on my lid just stamp it first and then blend it And then I'm going to take this brown color right here using this precise kind of a blending brush and then just stamp across this color on my lash line on top right here. Now this is just to make the brown more darker brown is why I am doing this. And now I'm going to take a nice clean fluffy brush like this and just go over all the shades very lightly. Now using a very thin pencil brush I'm going to take this bronzy color right here and add this on my lower lash line. So I'm gonna finish the rest of my makeup and be right back. So guys, this is the finished eye look.
and I'm just going to deepen up the crease line. And now I'm going to take a concealer brush like this one and use this beautiful gold shade. Now I have not wet the brush or anything, I'm just going to use it as it is because I know this is freaking pigmented. Next, I'm going to use another concealer brush and go over with this beautiful rose gold shade. And I'm going to go over with this grayish color at the last and use a pencil brush and literally stamp it in the outer corners of my eyes. And then I'm going to take a nice fluffy blending brush like this one and go over that black color lightly in circular motion and blend it along with the rose gold shade. So I'm going to complete the rest of my makeup and be right back. And I am back and this is the finished makeup look. However, I forgot to add a little bit of a pop on the inner corners of my eyes. So for that, I'm going to take this shade right here and use a very thin kind of a concealer brush and just add that right here. So I'm just adding the same shade on my nose just for a quick highlight and it looks amazing. So yeah, this is the finished look. Alright, so this wraps up today's video you guys. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, do not forget to subscribe to my channel and click on the bell icon right next to it so that you're notified whenever I do upload as well as like the video and comment down below if you have any questions or requests. I will try my best to do that for you as well as follow me on my socials which is It's a Shanair on Instagram and It's a Shanair on Twitter as well. So until the next time, take care. Bye.